Get away with this, okay? Thank you so much! Really, Raiden? Ripping off people's clothes? You cannot proceed any further via the rooftops. There is a freight railroad underground. The elevator ahead will take you to it. the railroad. It would appear so, likely part of Denver's old system. This city was a major transport hub in the early years of freight trains. This particular line appears to have been abandoned some time ago. It was originally constructed to transport supplies to an underground factory. But now, it seems even the electrical system is no longer functioning. Yeah, it's pitch black in here. As a cyborg, I trust this is not a serious concern. Still have not noticed you. Do not expose yourself.
There is a maintenance shaft up ahead. Use it to return to the surface. I'll just buy a quick souvenir or two for Rose and that'll be it. Raiden, we must hurry. Remind me to teach you about sarcasm sometime. I understand your attempts at humor. I simply do not find them entertaining.
That's my boy. Seriously now, Ryder. Isn't this all a bit much? Any decent lunatic would have quit after Mexico. Jetstream Sam. I heard you drop the lad Ripter in half. Old habits die hard, eh, Jack? But now here you are. The child soldier. Fighting for the children. <laughs> Please. What do you really expect to accomplish here? Place things into a bunch of brains? And what? Learn a medal? Think about it, Jack. No matter how many next to you. But you're a man on a mission. Aren't you? Gonna fix everything. Just you. And your little sword there. Solve everything with violence. Is that it? My sword is a means to an end. To protect those you'd prey on. Really? Let me ask you. All those cyborgs you've killed up to now. Maybe they weren't kids, but they were people. You ever think about them? when you're chopping them into hamburger? <laughs> they're adults. They made their choice. Sure they're adults. Sure they signed up for this. Right on the dotted line of their BMC contract. Usually they're no strangers to war. In fact, many times they already lost a limb or two. Many times they were out of work and starving on the street. So yes, they sign up for surgery to fight God knows where. How else would you provide for your family when your country's embroiled in civil war? Pain receptors shut down, pumped full of fear inhibiting nanomachines and sent right into the blender? Your blender? But they made their choice, right? Open your eye and see, Raiden. I've seen plenty. Then listen. Those battlefield emotions that the nano suppress. Listen to them. What are you talking about? Shh. There he is! Kill him! <laughs> Can we take him? What's wrong? The way he killed all the others? Oh God. Please God, don't let me die. Let's do this! <laughs> Listen closely now. Die! This life! I watched my wife and son die. This is all I have left. You ain't shit! Goddamn, I need you my legs. <laughs> I need a job. Stop! I didn't know what I was signing up for. <laughs> Something the matter, Raiden? <coughs> I've nearly saved enough to bring Mama to the States. Finish him off! Whatever it takes to be free of this torture. Stop it! What am I even <laughs> Choice. Not like you. People. 
are different. As opposed to AIs? You're all the same, huh? You and your brothers. Manipulating mankind for our own good. It appears my statement has upset you. I apologize. <laughs> no, it's... I know you're right. As for AIs, we adapt as we learn. Just as any intellect operates, man or machine, altering the course of mankind is not among my divine directives. I guess that's a relief. Samuel's behavior does not match established parameters. You know him? Affirmative. We served together on three previous missions. He proved most capable. You think highly of him. I have always found him... dependable. Until now. Scouting data for the next area. I'll patrol ahead. You follow.